guys, it's Misty Eyes, and I'm here with Sexy Saturdays for Queens of the Week. This week's topic is from Pedro Lola Mendez, and she wants to know our Christmas list. Be greedy. What would you want if Santa could bring you anything? But gosh, this is a hard question for me. I have not had a Santa Claus in 15 years, or about 15 years. Um, well, honestly, for the last three years, my Christmas present to myself was the Drag Stars at Sea. Um, that was my Christmas present to me. Since I buy myself my own Christmas present, thank you very much. <laughs> um, uh, but gosh, be greedy. Um, I guess my Christmas present for next year, I would really, really want Alan Chuck to do the Drag Stars of Seas again. That would be my Christmas present to me next year. If it's around Christmas time, of course. Um, if I did have a Santa Claus, I think I would want a really high metabolism. Can you make that happen? Um, I don't know. I'm, I've just been single for so long and, uh... I haven't lived with my family. I, I don't, I'm not used to th having, a, oh, baby, can you buy me this? I want this. Um, maybe I would want the new iPhone 6. Maybe I would want a new car. But I really like the Honda Elements, and they don't make them anymore. So I would want something big and tall, and I don't know. I'm, I'm starting to get over my car because it's oldish. It's a 2006. But I really love it at the same time, so I don't know. Um, oh, I know what I want. I want a whole new bedroom set, meaning nothing in my bedroom matches. I have three dressers that don't match. I would want a. I actually went to City Furniture and saw one that I like. Um, a whole headboard, shelves, dressers had a light up headboard um that's what i would want for christmas if i had a boyfriend or a husband or somebody to be my santa claus i would want a new bed the house down i also want a new couch and a new metabolism <laughs> health insurance would be nice i don't know this is a hard one for me you guys oh my god i'm back from the cruise and i'm so healthy right now, although I have been sick for the last several days, um, I got food poisoning. Or I got some weird Mexican disease when I was in Mexico from eating salad or drinking the ice cubes in the water. Or I could have got food poisoning from the ship. I don't know. All I know is that I woke up on the last port, which was Honduras, and I was so sick I couldn't get off the boat. It was so bad. Anyways, so I've been taking it really easy since I've been back, sleeping, catching up on sleep, and just resting my body. Um, so I'm back. My house is not unpacked. My drag is not unpacked. But I am home, and I'm well, and I'm back on Queens of the Week. And I found out we have two new girls that happened while I was gone. So I'm back, and I am recording for Queens of the Week. I've got some ideas for some Misty Minutes and things coming up, too. So I'll be back recording again, hopefully. Um... But yeah, I don't really know what to say. I don't have a Santa Claus, and I don't know what I would want from him. But I, um, but yeah, that's what I would want. Um, another cruise next year. Alan Chuck, please, thank you very much. I mean, this was my third year on the Direct Stars at Sea, and I think my very favorite. Yeah, things went wrong. I'll do a recap video, so I'll totally tell you some things the good and the bad and the ugly but i always say it's not where you go it's who you go with and i was surrounded by amazing people that really just wanted to have fun and i did and yeah there were some people on the boat that were mad and they wanted it to be an all gay private charter and you know shit happens but what are you gonna do sit in your own pout or are you gonna make the best out of it and i made the best out of it granted i got really sick Anyways, yeah, so that's Misty Eyes with Queens of the Week. My Christmas list would be Alan Chuck again for my fourth year. 
Um, a new bed, a new couch. Actually, just a whole new bedroom set and a whole new living room set. And maybe a new car. Maybe not. And a new metabolism. I don't know. How do I go from not wanting anything to wanting, like, super expensive shit? That's weird. Um, but guess what? I'm weird. Loving you is easy. Bye.